Okay, here we are. This is level 20, and this is uh, this is definitely a map that comes to mind when this mod is mentioned. Uh, this is Stasis, and the innovation, the, uh, the th thought process of WSJ was amazing when he designed this map. It's uh, with a, he's always just seemed to be ahead of his time when creating mods. And this, ma this map is um, definitely one of those memorable ones. Not just in this mod, but in, in all of the wolfing community. This is... This is amazing. But um, anyway, this is our first new enemy. The STG guy. And of course, he drops the STG. Now, is he tougher than the S uh, SOD Reloaded STG guy? I'm not really sure. But uh, one thing is for sure... You don't want to deal with... You don't want to be messing around with these guys. So, uh, we'll just get rid of them. Oop, two of them are coming. I really don't want to... Fiddle around with them too much. Get rid of them quickly. Okay. Now, take a look. We've got mutants in the wall like that. And they... Um, they're little wallflowers, I guess. I don't know. They kind of wait around until you step on a certain tile. And then they come to life. See, you can touch them. And until you shoot them or step on a tile, a certain tile somewhere, they just kind of sit there. There's another STG guy. All by himself, he's not really a problem. But um, anyhow, we got a flak jacket, plenty of health. Uh, WSJ is very um, generous with health. So that's a good thing. This door won't open for us. It'll be open soon enough. I need some power distance shooting here. We've got, uh, we've got uh, STG dudes. Okay, now I'm gonna try to stick with this. I do want to save. I would really like to save my STG rounds. Thought somebody would be coming. Okay, I guess not. I know somebody's gonna come to life, but here's a guy right here. dude over here and then one over here okay and is there a guy there he is okay and in oh there's one more here we go I knew there was another guy okay let's go kill this guy in here here's our new enemy it's the chain gun dude he's very he, he's actually pretty quick he doesn't have much of a wind-up time, but he will go down quickly enough with the STG. So, we grab his chain gun, come on out here. We've got STG dudes. Once again, we really, really don't want to be diddling around here. I thought there was one more. I thought there were four. Did I kill four? I don't know. I don't trust it. Uh, there's no more health back here, right? Oh, these are pretty cool rooms. Uh, I, don't, I think we got what we came for. Yes, okay. Oh, well. I thought there were four STG guys. Onward we go into this part, and what do I want to do? I need to get that. Um, is a flak jacket, or did I grab it already? I think I grabbed it. Uh, I'm not going to worry about the health. Oh, did I mention um, all three secrets that are in this map? They're all right at the start. Some fuel right there, and also the exit is right here. But, of course, we need the elevator key. So, onward. And here I would suggest that we save... Ah, STG, dudes. Okay. Um... Guy over there, more wallflowers. I 
I don't think there's anything over here. This door doesn't open for us. And we got a guy right here. Okay, flak jacket. Uh, how's my? I'll will save those boxes there. And I'll just take I'll take that. That's fine. Okay, now we're coming to the real um, crux of this whole map. This whole map. Scientists here. Yeah. <laughs> I love picking on the scientists like that. All right, so let's get this wallflower over here, and then um, I know some of them. Let's grab that guy over there. Let's get him. And I thought another one would be coming down. Maybe not. Oh, oh, oh. It's so hard to tell exactly where they're going to spring to life. I can never seem to uh, pinpoint exactly what is going to happen. Oh, oh, come out. Oh, one more. I think this is the last one. All right. Okay, good. Now, um, we're going to be dealing with these um, behemoths shortly enough, but let's go back and grab some more health. Actually, before I do that, because I want to have as much health as possible. Let's get rid of that guy, and this guy, yes, okay. So I'm going to save those little med kits over there. I'm going to run back and grab some more health over here. Yeah, let's just top off here. How's this? Um, I really don't want to use up those boxes. All right, let's get our uh, chain gun ready. Power armor. Now, this armor is going to replenish itself over time, so we'll always have 100% armor. Uh, let's scoop up this ammo, and as soon as we open the door, the key is in there. But um, I don't suggest going in there to get the key. I recommend opening the door, turning around, and killing this guy immediately, and then this guy. So open the door, turn around, start shooting right away, and then start shooting right away. Okay, and then scoop up health, scoop up health, let's go. Okay, now with that, with those guys down, we can grab the portable MG42. And just let these guys have it while they're at a distance. That's why it's so important that they die immediately. And here comes another one. Oh, oh, oh. Use the STG. STG wipes them out so quickly. And now we can grab the elevator key. And with that, we are going to be facing even more guys. And I'd suggest, once again, just shoot. Don't even worry about anything else. Just get them while they're far away. So you run out of ammo. Okay. They're all done. Let's, um, what do I want to do now? Um, there's nothing else over here. Let me just make sure all of my ammo is topped off here. I think we're good. Healthy health. 
rifle rounds. Eighty, eighty, three, three, and zero, two. Yes, that's right. Because we have to go and get the um, the one ups. And uh, I don't know where I'm going. I need to go. Which way am I going? <laughs> this way. <laughs> Getting spun around here. Here's the beginning. One ups are in here. 80, 83, 3, 2, 2. All right. Floor 20, stasis, all done. Oh, and here's the flat gun component. You can't miss it. It's right at the elevator. We'll see ya. It's a trap. After reaching the next level, you enter a room and see a guard and a scientist. Before anyone can fire, the door behind you locks and green gas begins to fill the air. The scientist quickly injects himself with some kind of antitoxin, but it's too late for the guard. His skin turns pale and he goes berserk, killing the scientist. You then kill the mutated guard. You take some of the scientist's antitoxin just in time, but it was only enough to slow the effect of the gas, not cure it. You need to find the exit before you succumb to the gas. Eighty-eight, three, three, 